In the small island where the fishers live here, they survive in a peaceful way. They walk around in small island. Some of them are migrating in other places. Maybe they want to have more food and experience. But they don't know what consequences they encounter when they migrate in other places. But let's focus in Iceland, which is our main story of this episode. A very cold place, a massive snowstorm, a fisherman walks towards to find a safe place. Because if not, fisherman will die in the cold. This is the beginning of survival. Run away from hunters. No choice to fight as long as can. from herbivores and fight some monsters and that's what they're doing to take their lives it is very hard for a little bee shooter to live in Iceland which is not suitable in their body like this with their condition But this fishhooter is lucky, unlike the other fishhooters are unlucky to survive. Like this one, frozen after snowstorm. And this one too, wasn't able to stand in the middle of snowstorm. I feel sorry for this fishhooter. I wish I could give a warm hug for this fishhooter, because not all fishhooters can survive in this situation. Now, no choice. Bee shooter must go out and take some food that can be eat, or else bee shooter will die in hunger. And finally, the bee shooter was changed by the nature's power, which means it is applicable in this weather condition. 
and after several years, Snoppy became Barsnake Snoppy and respected of all Snoppies. And that's the beginning of Snoppy ages. From Peashooter became to Snoppy, grow to Barsnake, and if Barsnakes die, another life will grow. From seed to baby Snoppies, it's a life cycle, and they are all happy. And Barsnake will never forget how hard to survive just to grow life easier for them. Okay, hello ma. Okay, 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 okay. One, two. Come on, come on, come on. 